Hey, what's up everybody? My name is TrophyNet and welcome back to The Witcher 3 on the Death March difficulty. Today we're gonna do another scavenger hunt for uh, the upgrade, the superior version of our uh, Wolf School gear. And we're still at Skellige, we're at uh, Fire's Doll where we uh, ended the previous contract. And now we're gonna first find the chest armor upgrade diagram. I'm gonna quickly show you the map. So uh, we were at Fire's Doll. And just to the west of it, well, southwest, is the first armor upgrade diagram. So the chest armor upgrade diagram. I'm showing you the map this time because uh, someone in the comments made the astute remark that I actually never showed the map. So, uh, true, true. And I, uh, that's completely my fault. So uh, I'm sorry for that. But from now on, on the scavenger hunts, I'll uh, show you the map at every upgrade diagram. So there you go. Southwest of Firesdall. But now we need to, of course, get it, and it appears there's uh, a lot of harpies in the neighborhood. Let's over here at that fancy fort, so you won't really be able to miss this now, can you? But let's clear this out first. And there we go, there's still a lot left over there, but I think that's enough for me. So let's loot everything here. I think there's a, a sign just outside the gate, probably. Another marking of a wolf. Ah, over there, on the ceiling. Does I need to examine that first I look around some. before he wants to continue. So I think it's actually on top of the walls. So we can get on top of it from the uh, north side and then if we walk around I think there's a chest over there. Yeah, there it is. Look at that! Well hidden, superior woven armor. There we go. So now we need the silver sword diagram so I'll meet you at its location in a minute. So next up I went uh, south southeast from Aaron Bjorn. I'm going to show you the map in a second. And there's this uh, elven ruin. Well, I think it's an elven ruin at least. So this is Aaron Bjorn, and then to the, the southeast of it, near these uh, circles, is the steel sword upgrade diagram, the silver sword upgrade diagram. So uh, let's head inside, but first, where's the, the wolf marking? Uh, it might be deeper inside of here. Where's the marking? Where is the marking? Oh, it's on the ceiling again. There we, there we go. Mm, I want to look around some. And then, well, there's not much here. There's a bunch of booze here, and then there's this green chest where the diagram is located in. It's weird. It's the only green container I've seen so far. But that's a silver sword diagram and I will head to the steel sword upgrade location. So see you guys there in a minute again. So next up the steel sword upgrade diagram is in some ruins. I'll show you the map. On the uh, eastern island in Skellige, I think this island is... Um, well, it's where Lofoten was, where we uh, cleared out Freya's garden. And uh, Morgvarg, I think, the werewolf. And it's on the, the west side of the island. You can go around here uh, to get to the ruins. And there's where the steel sword is located. So let's go find it now. Because there's apparently an ice troll over here. And no. And this one doesn't like fire damage. Okay.
go. He doesn't like fire now, does he? Can I loot him? Apparently not. But hey, let's see if we can't find a marker first around this wall. There we go. Hmm. I want to look around some. And it looks like we can go deeper inside here. Uh, so let's drop down slowly. Seems to be a lot of action inside here. So let's blow this uh, this place up. <coughs> oh, whoa, 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 wait. Oh, Jesus Christ. So that's a, a cheeky way of uh, clearing that out. But I used art, didn't I? Jesus Christ. Because there are a few chests in here. But we need to take care of the gas. Which comes back rather quickly. So I'm not going to waste too much time here. There it is. No, fire that. There's a lot of stuff here. Okay, going outside before I die. Holy shit, that was spectacular. So it's the the back left chest over there. And I think I accidentally activated something for the final preparations quest. I hope I don't do so further. But I'm going to continue on with part 4 of the uh, Woven Upgrade Diagrams quest, the scavenger hunt. And I'll see you guys at the next location, which is actually at Kaer Morin. So, we're back at Kaer Morin and we're at an abandoned iron mine. As you can see on the map, uh, south of Kaer Morin we have the marker for the iron mine. And then uh, following the path to the west will lead you towards towards the mine itself so it's right near this little bridge here uh, and uh, there's a few bears over here as well so uh, if you're close to those you're close to where you need to be and then we have this marker right, over here hmm. depleted sideways ago around some there we go uh, and then we can actually take a look around although it doesn't sound like there's much inside of here never mind there's another route i'm gonna use a cat potion as you can see i don't have the scavenger hunt part 4 uh active at the moment in my quest log oh hello that's because uh well this part is a bit bugged for me i don't have the quest but i still think i can get the diagrams maybe get rid of uh because this looks pretty bright. And I added some Alimenta oil to the mix as well. Another damage healer. The more the better, I would say. And there we go! Giant explosion. The Witcher's Forge. That actually sounds interesting in and of itself. That's not what we're here for, right? But hey, I might as well do that as well. Hmm. Seems to be a way through here. And here are the superior woven gauntlets to the left. To the right. To the right. What I'm saying? It's to the right. Over there. See, because I don't I can't even activate the quest, I think, of maybe I should check my quest log. So yeah, even though I uh, I found one just there I uh, still don't have it in my quest log so I'm gonna have to do this 
uh, well, flying blind as they say. So I'll meet you guys at the next location. So these were the gauntlets at the iron mine. So uh, we did this once for a quest, but uh, if you follow the river to the east uh, of Caer Morhen, you will eventually get up to a cave. We've been inside this cave before, but uh, this is also the location of the boots upgrade diagram. So the superior boots upgrade diagram. So the only thing I do need to check is where the uh, marker is, or I might have already done that. Not that it's required, so uh, let's head in and see if we can't find... Okay, it's pitch black darkness in here. But we're gonna find that chest here no matter what. There's a few Andrega warriors in here, but those shouldn't pose a threat at this level. So there's a lot of them, but uh, we're pretty overleveled for, to uh, be battling level 11 enemies. So we can just power through all of these. But the loot is nice, isn't it? Now let's take a look around here, because there might... Well, there is a chest here with the... Is it this one? No, probably not. Nope, 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 nope. This might actually be a great use for Cat, because I don't see shit. There we go. I accidentally took uh, a black blot as well, so that's my mistake. But it should be around here somewhere, if you go further into the cave. So there's a, a large formation of uh, stalagmites over here, so if you break them with art... We can walk through it, and over there is the chest, if I can reach it. If it would just break, there we go, the chest is right over here, to the western side of this larger area. There we have the boots. Now, if I get back out of here, so the last thing we need is the diagram, so the superior diagram for the boots. So I'll see you guys there in a minute again. So, the last diagram is actually located west of Caer Morhen. So if you take the route from the base of Caer Morhen all the way up to the northwest, we end up at another cave. Right here, that is. As you can see by my marker. God damn it. The wolf head. I know this place. They held the first trials of the grasses Almost here. Almost washed away. away. They built the fortress a few more decades and it'll be gone. Just like the witchers. Well, that's sad. So this is part of where the Trial of Grasses was held. But this is the icon I was looking mm. for, actually. Might want to look around some. There we go. And now we'll head in a bit further. There we go. And let's take a look around. Neckers and my sword got broken, so let's repair that immediately. Uh, weapon repair kit. There we go. There we go. Back to eighty percent. I think there was another necker here. Created, now infested with monsters. Mutation were carried out here. here. Nice acoustics. <laughs> And there was one devourer amidst those guys. So devourer blood, didn't see that often. There we go. Anything else around here? Crowns. What's this? That smell. Mutagens. Makes me want to vomit despite the years. Interesting. Because we're doing another quest in the meantime here again. I think... 
The chest is right over here again behind stalagmites. If I can loot it. There we go. Superior woven trousers. So we might return here to do this quest, but I'm uh, just gonna return to Oxenford right now and uh, upgrade our armor and weapons. So see you guys there in a minute. So, uh, back in lovely Oxenford and you'll, uh, well, Final Preparations has updated again for some reason. Don't really want to do any of that stuff, but I'm going to reach the uh, armor in a second and we'll try to upgrade our armor. So, hello, sir. Greetings again. So, you got a job for me, an interesting one. A very interesting one, superior gear. Uh, I'm actually wondering if they can actually make that or if we need another craftsman for this, but we'll see. You're in oh, that's fun. Okay, so we have the superior woven boots. Components missing. We need meteorite silver ingot. So that's one. Uh, the superior woven chest armor. Can we make that? Perhaps... Hello? Okay, why is it not here? Okay, let's first check out the other ones then. So the superior woven gauntlets, I can make that. And then the trousers. Superior woven trousers, we need another meteorite silver ingot. So let's craft those first. So two silver meteorite silver ingots. I'll make a few extra just in case. Uh, so we need that for the boots. Superior woven boots. So let's close that as well. We did the gauntlets. So we need to do the trousers. Upgrades, that's weird. Superior woven trousers. But now the question is where my armor is. Because that's troubling. Is it mistakenly put in something else? Because it doesn't look like it. Weird. So long. That is very, very weird. Okay, so it's here in the list, but why isn't it available when I uh, am at the blacksmith? Oh, I need a master armor for that. Okay, so that's why. So I'm gonna have to head to uh, Crow's Perch in a second as well. But first, let's check out the uh, weaponsmith here, the blacksmith. Ah. <coughs> and if he also doesn't, well, isn't able to uh, craft my weapons, then I'm gonna have to start going to Crow's Perch and uh, Hattori. And Novigrad to craft my stuff, and I'm gonna have to leave Novigrad, be uh, Oxenford, behind. Ah. Yeah, indeed. So craft something. Would yes, you? of course you will. So the crossbows. We can actually make one of the crossbows. I'm gonna check this out as well. So armor piercing, adrenaline point gain, or. Well, it does look like the uh, the feline. It's a bit better now, doesn't it? So I'm gonna make the feline crossbow. So we have one of those as well. And then we can make, maybe make the uh, superior woven silver sword. There we go, that's one. And then the superior woven sword steel sword. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we just need to go to Crow's Perch to craft the chest armor. So see you guys there. In a second, then. So, back at... Uh, how, what was her name again? Joanna, I think. Yeah, Joanna. Geralt, good of you to come by. So... What can I do for you? She's a master's armorer, so she should be able to... Uh, craft the chest armor, armor for me. Made. Witcher's armor. Okay. So, let's see what we need for that, because it should be in the list right now. Yeah, there we go. Superior Wolven Armor. We need two more Cured Dragon in the Ladder and two more Dimeridium Plate. And I think we can make that both. 
So two pure draconid. Oh, shite. So that's not gonna work. I'm gonna have to buy that one. And then dimeridium plate. And there we go. One and two. So let's head to the shop and buy some of that cured dragonet leather. Well, give me one to start off with. And then back to crafting. And go for the chest armor. Superior woven armor. Look at that. So I'm gonna quickly empty my inventory as well here. So thank you, Joanna. Take care now. And now of course, to put the, the cherry on top, I'm gonna equip it. So take a good last look at the enhanced version. And I'm an idiot because this was already the superior, because uh it's the first time we actually upgraded something we were wearing. So uh this is actually the superior woven gear. I also equipped the uh feline crossbow. So now we have a pretty nice gear. I'll let you check out the stats in a second. So the sword now does a whopping 248 to 304 damage. The silver sword does, uh, well, 100 more than that, a bit over 100 more than that. Um, then we have the chest armor, 180 armor, and the adrenaline point gain is uh, staggering. As well with the sign intensity bonus at the gauntlets with 63 armor. More attack power because of the boots with 67 armor. And 67 armor is also what the trousers give me with another 8% in attack power and a lot more resistances as you can see. So that's that, another uh, scavenger hunt. I hope this video might have helped a few of you guys. Uh, maybe because your quest was... Uh, okay, thank you. Was uh, bugged as well, such as mine. But hey, thank you guys enormously for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And if you haven't already, don't forget to give the thought to subscribe to my channel because I really appreciate any support you can give me. So thank you guys enormously for watching and I hope to see you in the next video stream. Goodbye!